Yo, welcome back to another hotel review. This time we are in Malaysia, Kuala Lumpur, KL. But before we go on further, I need you to like, comment, and subscribe. Do that for me, man. Help a homie out. So, um, this hotel is called the Five Elements Hotel. It's basically right next to Chinatown. In my opinion, it is very, very cheap. It may not be cheap compared to the other Chinatown hotels, but this is very, very affordable. And in my opinion, it's really nice and it's really clean. The staff was cool too. Uh, let me give you a quick tour. So this is my second night here. I stayed here one full night already, so pretty familiar with it. Uh, obviously the door, then you come here, you got the restroom. You do your business here. You know, you do your thing here. Um, they do give you two full body towels, but they don't give you a face towel. This is not a door. You can't close this. So, you know, your water can drip out if you're a messy person shower. They do give you some shampoo or body wash and some other stuff. I really don't know what that is. I guess I can step in. Oh, uh, what is this? Shower cap, soap, bath and shower. I have no idea what the hell mean to be bath and shower. Shampoo and conditioning. That's my stuff. Um. I will say here, this uh, this thing really suck, man. The water pressure really, really suck. Um, it's it's really weak, and it takes forever to get hot. So uh, I will say the restroom is really not that worth it. Restroom is really not that great. <sighs> Alright, the bed, uh, the bed is pretty hard. I ain't gonna lie, but I'm okay with a, with a hard bed. These pillows are super soft. So it's like soft pillows, hard bed. Honestly, I don't know if I slept well or not, uh, cause I kept waking up and I only slept like four hours or five hours. I don't know if it was a jet lag or what. Then you come over here, you got your uh, mini bar, not really, but you know your coffee station. Uh, I don't know what kind of coffee they give you. Okay, that's cool, some fancy stuff. They do give you two bottles of water every day and they do refill it. Um, I actually put my water in the fridge. That's how I know to actually refill it cause I drank one. And then they gave me two back and I just put one over here. That's pretty cool. Uh, got this nice little desk area for you to work on. But obviously you can see I just put all my mess there. Um, this chair was actually right here under the TV. Which I kind of don't understand why why the chair would be under the TV. Um, you can't really watch anything. But I moved the chair to the side because I just, you know. I guess they were expecting people to lay on bed and watch TV. Very real setup. Honestly, I haven't even turned on the TV, so I don't even know if it works. Um, got your other lamp here. I will say something I don't like about this. Um, there's no outlet, dude. There's no outlet, so you can't charge your phone by your bed on either side. So I, I, I don't like that. You can't charge your phone by your bed. You know, um. I, I do have to charge it here. They, they do have two outlets here. So it's not too bad. They do have two windows too as well. So you see all those lanterns right there? That's actually Chinatown right there. So this is the hotel. I don't think they have a pool. I don't think they have a gym. It's just very, very basic. I think I'm paying like 25 bucks a night. 25 USD a night. That's cheap, man. I can put the price down here. Uh, I just can't remember off the top of my head. I have to look it up. The location is great. As soon as you walk downstairs, there's like food everywhere, man. It's crazy, dude. It's food everywhere. Restaurant, food stall. And you got Chinatown right there too. You walk Chinatown, take me like a minute or two walk, and you and you right there. If you want to stay in KL and you want to be near Chinatown, I recommend this hotel, man. Um, the staff is really really nice. So yesterday I checked in, and he's either the boss or the owner or the manager. And we, we were talking, and uh, today I was coming upstairs, and he saw me again, and he greeted me. When the hotel people remembers you, it, it it means something to me, man. You know, I will say this, dude. I don't know about the security here, man. Cause um, earlier today I forgot my key card, my room card. I went downstairs to the lobby, and be like, hey, um, I'm locked out my room, um, twelve oh two, and they're like, okay, just go upstairs, wait. You know, I went upstairs. The 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 housekeeping person, he just let me in. If I like even verifying if, if this is my room or checking my ID to make sure it matched the you know the, the the registration or whatever, he just let me in. So I I, I could have been like, hey man, I'm like that on fifteen oh four. I I don't know. I, I just you know I, I don't know about that about that safety issue. But yeah, um, I felt I felt that was a little bit weird. Oh, there is one thing I forgot to mention. So my luggage is on the floor because um 
they don't have a luggage holder thingy i don't know if this is common a lot or not you know in america they usually have a place for you to put the luggage that little uh, rack thingy that y'all see me use it use in other videos they don't have one here they do have a lot of uh closet space but who who uses closet it's not the end of the world that they don't have it but that was one thing that you know i do like having now my luggage on the ground i do got to bend a little bit lower but and eh, it's not bad uh this room it is very very spacious in my opinion this is the lobby of the hotel i'm staying at pretty nice got a couch right here you can wait for your grab or whatever small table for you to eat if you check out early and you're not leaving yet they do hold your luggage for you I do recommend this hotel. You know, it's not no Marriott, it's not no um, Hilton or, or, you know, like some, you know, five star luxury stuff. You're not full resort. If you just need somewhere to sleep and you want to be close to Chinatown, I recommend this hotel, man. 100% I come back to this hotel. I appreciate you watching. I'm out. But before I'm out, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Man, just an extra review on this hotel. Um, this hotel's A plus, man. Um, I've been coming in and out this hotel every time I checked in. They still welcome me here. They even gave me water, man. Can't beat this hotel, man. I highly recommend this hotel. 10 out of 5, man. You gotta stay at this hotel, dude. The staff here is so nice.